Okay, let's see. I'm at Lava Bears National Monument, the entrance to Big Ice Cave, 12.21 p.m., Friday, March 11, 2022. I already went through this cave, but I actually had my camera set wrong, so I'm going to go ahead and go through it another time just to get the video I actually wanted. So anyway, if you watch my other videos for this cave, you notice the lighting has changed a bit. It's got a huge entrance, so the lighting matters. I don't know if you can see very well yet, but there's multiple levels in this cave. There's at least four levels, but only one of which I can really explore. Uh, it's not that I'm a beginner, it's just that it's really, really hard. Anyway, well, I just slipped on some loose dirt. I should probably be careful. Okay. I'm walking on a trail. That's one of the reasons I'm zigzagging. This used to be a tourist cave. All right, so here we go. So I'm looking down into a lower level. Been there, that's not very far. There's an upper level there that I cannot get into. So here we go, down, down, down. That white um, cannon, uh, shoot, what do you call it? Cylinder down there. That's got a um, sign-in sheet. I already uh, signed in yesterday, so I'm not gonna bother sign again. Okay, here we go. Now this cave does have six bats, so I'm gonna have to be uh, lowering my voice and the brightness of the camera, brightness of the light a couple times. So look at this, there's a way up there. That's too hard for me, but I'll bet you that's the way up to the upper level. Just sort of zigzag your way up there a little bit. Notice the ceiling is dozens of feet above me here. Crazy. Oh yeah, and this sign here right by the way up, I think, says The Big Ice Cave. So that's the name of this cave, The Big Ice Cave. Which is kind of annoying, because if you go on the internet and search for Big Ice Cave, you'll find the wrong one. You'll find it like the one in Montana. In fact, I bet there's a lot of caves in the world named Big Ice Cave because, well, there are a lot of big ice caves in the world. There. Anyway. Notice I can walk along that ledge here to this upper level. Well, this middle level, I should say. So check it out. I'm going to go up there eventually. There's an upper level up there. Whoops, hang on. My flashlight. Or... So there is an upper level up there. And then there is also a small lower level here. What's ironic, the trail goes to the lower level, but it's a dead end. I'm wondering though, if this cave used to have more ice, so the trail actually took people down to the ice level or something like that. Cause I, I like, um, I went to another cave around here, shoot. Uh, Caldwell Ice Cave. I was there like six years ago and the lower level it had a huge block of ice in it and then i went there about a month ago and the the ice level is like four feet lower it's like wow crazy luckily i got videos of both so hopefully eventually i can like show people hey look at how much the ice level changed that's only in like six years so in six years a lot of stuff melted I asked the rangers about it and they just said the past few winters have been really dry. So it hasn't been replenishing the ice at all. It melts in the summer and then it's not coming back in the winter. I'm not sure if that's permanent because of global warming or if that's just a weird, you know, chaos theory, whatever you call it. When you, okay. So I'm gonna walk along this ledge now, very carefully. It's not particularly safe, but it is doable. The trick is to not die. Okay, there we go. All right, so let me look down here. That's where I just was, about 10 feet down. That's the way I come across, believe it or not. There's a little nook back there. There's natural light from the only entrance that I had. No way. Yeah, yeah, I'm sticking out a different cave. Okay? That's the only entrance that I know of. And then there's the upper level, dozens of feet above me. 
Very neat cave. Man, I wish I could get myself up there. <laughs> of course, I said that in every video. This is actually my third video today because I shot one at 4K, three, 4K resolution, 60 frames per second. Then I meant to shoot the other one at 5K resolution and six, uh, 30 frames per second. But I had my camera set wrong, so I shot both of those at 4K resolution, 60 frames per second. So now I'm back doing it 5K for real, I hope. <laughs> anyway. Of course, what I'm doing is keeping my eye out for a better camera. My older camera, the GoPro Hero 7, I hate it. it it's so glitchy. It's, it, it just glitches out a lot. The Hero 7, or Hero 9 Black is a lot more reliable. But, okay, there's some bats up on top there. So I'm gonna go down here to the left. Take the lower level. There. Notice how the wall here on the right is almost completely vertical. It's crazy. And look at this. The ceiling is dozens of feet tall here. Oh, wow. Like Darth Vader once said, impressive. Most impressive. Let's say, face it, Darth Vader says so. It must be true. All right. You know, I wonder if you can quote, I wonder if you can copyright such a short phrase. Like, you know, how the Terminator always says, I'll be back. I wonder if they could copyright, I'll be back. Seems like it's like too short to copyright. What do I know? Okay, up here on the wall, there's a bat to the right, bat to the left. So I'm gonna stay down here, keep my distance, but I'm far enough down. My, I don't think my light's gonna affect them. This is cool. Look at this. This is officially an ice cave, but there's only like two pieces of ice in the whole dang thing. Here's one. And then here's the other. There. Told you it was an ice cave. <laughs> so by definition, ice cave is a cave that has ice year round. Okay, I went up over the cross top before. I want each video to be a little different. So I'll go ahead and go through the middle here. Let's stay to the right. I gotta show you something here. I wanna pan down. 